Hello guys and welcome back to another video in my underrated player of the week series. Today we're going to be looking at the team of the week 7 player, Dirk Coit. On the card face he has some average stats at best with high points of 82 shooting and 82 physical. His in-game stats however show some really good stats. He's got 94 stamina which for anyone who's actually seen Coit play knows that that's still too low. He's also got 84 crossing and 80 passing with 81 heading. In his shooting stats, he's got 87 positioning, 80 finishing, 85 shot power and 89 penalties. And to finish it off, he's got 85 reactions. He's also got 3 star skills with 2 star weak foot. The team that I decide to play him in has got the same backbone as the team which I usually use, which consists of Casillas in goal, with the defence of Juan Fram, Martinez, Mark Bartra and Gaia. For the chemistry with Coit, we went with Vilhina, Bazoya, with Oliver Torres completing the midfield trio. Supporting Dirk up front is Jesse Rodriguez and Benzema, who I'd swap in-game with Coit at half-time to put him as a striker. Getting into my opinion with Coit now, I found that his stats on the card face definitely didn't reflect on how well he was able to play in-game. All of his stats felt a lot higher. His pace seemed more around the 80 range as he was easily quick enough to play as a right winger and a right forward. His dribbling was what impressed me most about him as he was able to weave in and out of opponents and overall just keep the ball close to his feet. So I'd say that that's in the low 80s. His physical ability was also really good as he was able to outmuscle defenders and win most of the balls in the air which I played to him. I didn't end up playing any long passes with him but his ability to always find his teammates with rather a short pass or a through ball made him really consistent. In the 5 games that I played with him I managed to score 5 goals and assist 3 times which I was really happy with considering his stats. I'd keep his shooting around the 82 as I only scored goals which used his finishing. Overall I'd recommend everyone to try him out as he was a very good player for the 14k that I paid for him and because of how much I enjoyed using him I'd give him a 10 out of 10 for value. Thank you all for watching and I'll catch you in the next one.